brand new vehicle in the game and it is called the Bravado Buffalo EVX, I believe, and this is it right here. So this car is going to be located actually in the legendary motorsport section. So right here, very first car, and you guys can see that this thing is worth quite a bit of money. Very expensive, just like all the other cars. And just to talk about real quick of the couple things about this car, it is an electric car, right? It's an electric car. And then also it's an HSW car. So we're gonna be able to put HSW modifications on this vehicle. So we're gonna go through the modifications right now. And then after this, we're gonna go to the airport and we're gonna test this vehicle with another HSW car, not necessarily the fastest one in the game, but you know, we wanna see how fast this car goes. Is it even gonna hit the top 10 list? So there it is right there. How much did that cost me? One point plus four million dollars. So at this point right now, guys, we're already past three point five million dollars for this car. And you guys can just go ahead and like add up the rest of the costs if you want. But I'm gonna like guesstimate we're probably gonna be in the four million dollar mark with this vehicle. And is it going to be worth it? I'm gonna be answering that question more towards the end of the video here. First things first though, we gotta get through all of the front bumpers here, which it looks like there's quite an array of like front bumpers. But then check out the back bumpers. There's only like four back here. What's up with that, man? I don't know, it just feels kind of weird how there's like so many front bumpers, but like four back bumpers or something like that. But hey, here we go. So here's the hoods right here, which it just looks like uh, my hood is, I, it looks like a swimming pool. It looks like an empty swimming pool. I'm, I'm serious so when it rains my hood's gonna fill up and we can just have like a swimming pool right there and it's gonna be it's gonna be good to go liveries do not disappoint me uh, racing stripes seen it before seen that one seen it before this is all this isn't new that sucks whoa whoa this one is promising look at this livery that is a nice livery right there can you change the color of it I bet you can we got the sprunk livery uh, and then HSW liveries like who goes with the HSW liveries those are lame too dude this one is cool I'm using that one right there and then other modifications so you can put like a little back part right here which is gonna be good you know potentially if you're getting shot which we're playing Grand Theft Auto when when aren't we getting shot right by police other players things like that of the nature all right guys so we're just gonna go through this mirror mirror on the wall What's the best mirror of them all? I don't know. We'll figure it out here. You know, does anybody really even care about mirrors? Why are there like so many mirrors? Some cars don't even have like but three mirrors to choose from. This one's got like 12, so that's cool. All right, now check this out right here. So this says mode, all right? And then we got like this right here. So we're just gonna go with the HSW like premium plus package or mode. I don't know, a little bit weird because what this car does not have, like, if you guys notice it or not, is going to be, like, the turbo or the transmission. This car doesn't have, like, any turbo or transmission. It just has that, like, mode thing right there. So I don't know if that's going to be, like, you know, the replacement of it. But, like, as we're going through here in plates, yeah, Rockstar, still don't have custom license plates. Are we ever going to have those? Probably not. Whatever. All right. Anyways, from there, you guys, we're going to go with, uh... Some roll cages. We got roll cages. Gonna buy a roll cage. Most expensive roll cage is well over twenty thousand dollars. Seriously, you'll be lucky if you make over twenty thousand dollars doing a job. <laughs> All right. Anyways, here's the roofs. A lot of different roofs to choose from. Wow, there actually is a lot of different roofs to choose from. I don't really like any of them. I'm gonna be talking about more of uh, my opinion on this car though, as we get to the racetrack over there at the LSIA uh, there. All right, so for skirts, can't really notice much of a difference for any of these skirts whatsoever. This one's probably gonna be the most noticeable right here. So we're just gonna go with that one. And then of course, let's go with these spoilers. I guarantee you Rockstar put in a huge spoiler for this car. Yep, there it is. <laughs> oh my God, it looks so ugly too. Why would you even put a giant spoiler on this car, dude? Oh my god. Ready for some down like sometimes they have like the most ugliest. Okay, well there's a uh, suspension. Yeah, beyond that, dude, there's no freaking, there's no turbo or transmission. Unless I just, I didn't see it, I didn't see it. 
And then for tires, of course, now we have the ability of putting like chameleon colors on our rims, which is actually something that, you know, we've been doing for a while, you know, in the, in the, the glitch community. All right, guys, so there it is. This is a fully upgraded, brand new Buffalo. Just came into the game, fully upgraded. So what we're gonna do now is we're gonna take this thing on over to the LSIA, where we're gonna be racing one of my friends here to see what this car happened. No, I didn't want to go back in there. All right, so here we are, and my car uh, is fully upgraded, and then my friend's car is fully upgraded too. And by the way, he's using a Cyclone 2, which I think registers, if you guys were to look this up, I think this is from the last knowledge that I know of, is it's like the 11th or 12th fastest car in the game. So right here, my friend in the Cyclone 2 just got a well awesome, amazing start right there. Yeah, so... And it doesn't look like I'm catching up to him. Wow. So I just want to remind you guys that I spent about $4 million on this car that doesn't even go faster than the Cyclone 2, which doesn't even hit the top 10 fastest cars in the game. Literally, it doesn't. The Cyclone 2 is a very fast car, but guess what? It's not the fastest car in the game. It doesn't even hit the top 10 list, which is why uh, I wanted to race something like that. Not necessarily the fastest car in the game, but it looks like every car almost that has HSW modifications is going to trash this car. So my friend is giving me a head start here. And just in a second, you guys are going to see a very sad sight, which, you know, a $4, a four million dollar car. Like, come on, bro. And there he goes. Yeah, see ya. So I was very disappointed. Also, I do not like the way that this thing looks. I think it's ugly. I think it's trash. The performance on it sucks, obviously. We just proven that. And for people to waste four million dollars on this vehicle, nope, sorry, bud. I'm gonna go ahead and uh, just go ahead and sell this car right now, but yeah, because I don't even want this thing in my garage. I think it's ugly, and the performance is horrible with it being an HSW modified car on new gen. But from there, you guys are going to have to let me know what your thoughts are on this vehicle down in the comment sections below. And if you enjoyed the video, please hit that like button. It helps the channel somehow. We don't know, but it does because everybody says to do it. But from there, you guys should subscribe to the channel if you're new so you don't miss out on daily Grand Theft Auto 5 online content. And I... I'm Gravesite. <laughs> I'll see you guys in the next one. So, peace.